<laughs> uh, all right, so lots of focus on the forecast for the next few days, and we understand first alert weather uh, alert for Wednesday night into Thanksgiving. Yes, and th this isn't going to be huge weather, but it's just, you know, you're getting out, you're going to see family, give yourself a couple extra minutes, everything's going to be fine. But we have these uh, clearer skies right now. It's going to be a nice night. We'll mix in a few clouds from time to time, but I think tonight should be real quiet. And uh, temperatures are pretty mild here at the moment. But Futurecast, this tells the story of what we're going to be dealing with. You can see here, we get to tomorrow morning, those clouds are already starting to move in. So we're going to have some clouds around. I think it's going to stay dry until late. This is 4 p.m. Just maybe a little spotty shower trying to show up at this point, and it's going to be too warm for snow at this point, so some rain showers attached. Now we get into midnight on Thanksgiving morning, the wee morning hours up along I 80. We could see some snow showers, northern Venango up into Warren County, uh, Forest County, northern Clarion, northern Jefferson County. Everyone else is still looking at rain, but we're going to see some colder air start to mix in here, and that could mix in some snow. Now with the rain ahead of it, it's going to have a hard time sticking, but we could get maybe a little slushy accumulation, especially up north or in the ridges eventually um, as, as we work throughout the day. But I think we start to see some drying trying to take place, and then we get into Friday morning and we could see some additional snow. So PM snow on, on uh, the day tomorrow. I don't think there's going to be much going on here. Uh, your your uh, holiday weekend kicks off on Wednesday. You see those clouds through much of the day. You get into Thanksgiving and we're going to see that rain and snow trying to take over and that's going to be with us, especially up front. And when it comes to accumulations uh, into the wee morning hours of Thursday, we're not going to be really racking up too much. Uh, once we get into Thursday and Friday night, we'll see a little more trying to stack up in the ridges, especially Especially, but this isn't going to be big snow. Now, if you're going up towards uh, Buffalo and towards the lakeshore uh, around Erie and eastward, that's where you could run into some issues. Tonight, though, freezing at uh, 31 degrees, partly cloudy skies, those chilly temperatures, and then tomorrow we're going to get those highs back into the mid-40s, mostly cloudy, and it's the evening where some rain and snow tries to show up. From there, we're going to uh, get into Thursday. Rain and snow, a KDK first alert weather day. Some snow showers around on Friday. I think Saturday's going to be quiet but cold at 30 degrees. And those lower 30s take us into Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday of next week.